Hi everyone, welcome to my channel. My name is Angelica Perez and here's another makeup look that I'm going to be doing and it's this green eyeshadow look and it's either for 420 or just a green eye eyeshadow to do. And with this eye look, I use the palette from Jeffree Star, which is the Morphe by Jeffree Star. And I use all the green shades from here. And I created this look right here, which I'm about to show you. I did this off camera and I'm about to do the other one. I'm showing you guys how I did this makeup eye look. So without further ado, let's get it started. First things first, I'm going to use my concealer. Mm -hmm. From Tarte Shape to Tape. Then I'm going to blend that with a sponge. And honestly, this is my first time doing a green eye look. I normally do neutrals. Oh shit, I blocked y'all guys. I'm blocked. So next from the palette, I'm going to use Wake and Bake. This will be the first shade we're going to use. And I'm going to use a Morphe brush. The name is getting off. That'll be this one right here. I'm picking more of the shade. Now I'm just, you know, tapping the shade or the sh eyeshadow to stay in place. Now with a different brush, I'm going to be using the Morphe M15. So yeah, guys, I messed up with the brush. The brush is M513, not M15. Here. <laughs> I'm going to pick up the shade Nate. I'm going to be using Nate. Pick up more shade. I 
now I'm going to pick up the shade Vaseline. With the same brush, I am going to just tap it quick. I don't know how to like that. Picked up a little bit of black eyeshadow and I'm going to tap the rest off and then I'm going to darken up the green eyeshadow like that. You see that little spot? Yeah. Just lightly blend that black eyeshadow. Makes the green eyeshadow darker. As you can see, that's how I got that green eyeshadow. But I'm going to blend that. Blend it really, really good so it won't show a lot of blackness. Now with the concealer, I'm going to put some right here and I'll pick some concealer up with a flat brush, like this one. And I'm going to cut my crease so we could put this shimmer shade. Just like that. I'm gonna dry my concealer a little bit. Now with another with another flat brush, I'm gonna pick up the shade dry through. This is this green um shimmer? Then I'm going to put it right here. So once again, I messed up with my cut crease, but I'm going to eventually fix it in this video. But I will get it right next time. Wait there. I'm going to go ahead and fix that little spot. For that, I'm going to use had a brush. I'm going to use this brush right here. It fits right through there. Actually, let me get a smaller brush. There you go. Okay, now I'm going to do a wing. Okay, so on this part, I'm going to finish doing my eyeliner off camera because my eyes were getting watery and my eyes were getting red as well. So yeah, guys, no, I am not high. My eyes were just red and getting watery. I do not know why. 
<laughs> so I finished doing the eyeliner. So for the next step, we're going to do the waterline. Basically, we're going to do the same thing, but with a smaller brush. We're going to go the same way. We're going to pick up the shade Wake Bake, Nate. And after wake bake, neat, and after that is the fast line to darken up the green. So I'm gonna show you. And this is the shade wake bake. Okay, after wake bake, I'm gonna use neat. More of the shade in eight. Then after that, I'm going to just quickly tap on the shade fast lane. And there's one that's like that. Okay, so for the inner corner, for the inner corner, we're going to use the shade Glam Rapids. This one right here. And we're going to highlight the inner corner with this. So now I'm gonna put some mascara and eyelashes and I'll be back. Alrighty guys, this is the final look that I created with the palette Morphe by Jeffree Star. And as you can see, I did a green eye look and actually this is my first time actually playing with green eyeshadow, honestly, because today's 420. And if you like this video, give it a thumbs up. If you enjoy, enjoyed this video, give it a thumbs up or like this video. Don't forget to subscribe to my channel and comment down below what did you like about this video. <laughs> and yeah, you could always change the lip color to something that you feel like goes with the green eyeshadow. I just did this because I really don't know what goes with green eyeshadow. But yeah, guys, thanks for watching and don't forget to subscribe to my channel. Bye.